وعوني منه الليلة نعم في مسجد عباد الرحمن مع شيخنا في بوتشان الذي سافر من جامبيا خصوصا للدعوة ونسأل الله سبحانه وتعالى أن يجعل خطاه في ميزان حسناته آمين وندعو أيضا للمستمعين الذين يتجولون معه في أي مساجد من مساجدنا قصدا ليستفيدوا ونسأله سبحانه وتعالى أن يجعل القاعدة ما يؤذي منازلنا ويقينا في حياتنا الدنيا والآخرة ثم نذكر المهاجر في بوتشام وأيضا إمام المسجد نشكره ونشكر الأمير وجميع المسلمين وكل من له نصيب في تطوير هذا المكان يوفر لنا قاعة نبث فيه كلمة ونبث فيه علما ونسأل الله سبحانه وتعالى أن يكتبنا من المقبولين أمين أجزاكم الله خيرا إن شاء الله نخبر المقدر إلى أستاذنا أبو هلال على يؤلق على ما قلنا اللي واجب هذا السنواري موجود هو محاضرين عشان وكذا في الجبال ولكنني <تصفيق> بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على رسوله الكريم نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين من أتنت تبارك وتعالى Mesede ala ku adam malam Ala main sayato Mesede ala ku adam ma Lenya nakabatu Bada ni laki sola Ani nemu Ayake na nabi umoye Nikata Muhammad Abdullahi dimma Nala tanyun Nala dimba Ani mumu blata simfa Noma kujeni Yuma kiyama Nde almamu lkontona Nde jamu mkono mteta masjid Ibadur Rahman Almamu 
ani mos komiti ani salil albe adna nyeng alfa alfa nan tentu kata sa sohnati ani ala ustaz baba jagana ani ustaz kotte ngolbe alhamdulillah be bending bi suto lanyu masjid ot in kala mota ndeko masjid kutola al sawon taja ya je kol man timma wala na rebeti ala bake bi suto nyo kachandi asadaq wala mo kasada bo Bon dero ken ka ke fi sabi la Bon nga no su sonde i do ko me alon ko alfali adati ay timba ay timba ay ya ni me dun na ka cha ko no ngal be konton assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh wa alaikum assalam de ala daniela asem man tabe ani sidulat la asna junubol kafa asna hajul jara asna quran tol kende ande na the sheikh after praising allah he begins in the name of allah the most gracious the most merciful he sends salutations upon the prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam and his family and all his companions He says praise due to Allah and he bears witness that there is no deity worthy of worship except Allah. He is the only one who deserves to be worshiped. He asks Allah to send his salat and salam upon the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. He would like to greet the Imam of the Masjid, the elders of the Masjid and all the people present in this beautiful place, the Masjid called Ibadur Rahman. He greets Ustaz Baba He greets Ustaz Sohna and all the other Ustazes sitting here today. And he say it pleases him that we gather in this place. He is informed that it is a new masjid. This is why things are still not completely ready yet. And so it is even more important that he speaks of what he wants to speak about today, which is charity, giving sadaqah, to encourage us all to complete this place and to increase in giving in the way of Allah. He says, but before he begins, he would like to greet you all with the greeting of Islam and says to you, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. He asks Allah to forgive all of our sins and to take care of all of our affairs and to heal all of our sick people. Barakallah. ألا تبارك وتعالى أكون من ذا الذي يقرض الله قرضا حسنا جمال ذا ألا دنتلا دنتر نمالا سبحان الله جمال يبارتك ألا دنتر ألا كنا ذي الجولة أبا دبولا المين أبارك فرك ألا دنتر ibe dunya dawada baraka ala dont alam yalon ko abu kala lahi do fe na beri nyin ayo jita yahudo eko he muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam ala ala kamim batu afwariyata afwariyata fain aka dontoro leke sai Yenna ko ala afwariyata wala tinaka don toro ni sai alna ala la don toro ji ba ka tamin to fontol kanan ko ala ko bulo la ba a fele wala kamane boto le sanga samba ala don toro momenti wala mo nga ke nyoye nga nyo nafa nga nyo de ma 
to akamun tako alala wodon toro akamuru minto akamuru ala jomalleka hu al ghani atafan kama yatale aman solan ton ya aliyati mo ma koy ala ko be jola ya muso ma ko mi alam ko ake fatota ala ko be jola ala la bu mo fele bela ferin ka dada yela gudu to dunje yela dola dunje ala ko be jola yen don dole ninna mu ala subhanahu wa ta'ala don dote al nga pare na ala don to subhanahu wa ta'ala abe jola ko ye kontan ala ma ala mbulo mulkon le cheikh he continues he says allah mentions in the ayah the meaning of which in english allah says who will give a goodly loan to allah so that allah may repay them he says subhanallah allah is saying who will give a loan to allah a good loan so that allah will pay them back and when allah he is paying them back he will double their pay he says subhanallah this is great we should all be ready to give a loan to allah the one who never fails his promise he says when this ayah was revealed some of the yahud the jews they used to say that muhammad or muhammad's lord sallallahu alaihi wasallam has become so poor that now he's asking people for loan they say allah has become so poor he's asking people for loan the sheikh he says but look and pay attention what is allah's loan is he asking us does he bring his hand and say give to me is he asking us to feed him with a bag of rice no allah is requesting from us a loan that will benefit us he is requesting from us a loan that will help us a loan that will increase us only because he is al ghani he is not in need of anyone he says if you help an orphan allah will pay you if you help a widow allah will surely pay you he says whoever helps especially helping the masjid the house of allah whether you put in a butud whether you put in what we refer to as a cent or a dollar he says allah will surely reward you he says then let us all prepare to be from those who will succeed those who give a loan to allah and he asks allah to make us from all of them kila sallallahu alaihi wasallam anata ala kuma kamalto ako sadaqatu burhan ako sada mudalil ulati tunna li afasar iko koto munati wala mudalil ulam min ka tandiko amari adankene ada min ka sada bondi akadi dalil ulam ka tandiko nyin limaniya basi soko munatina iko skodo dia tale dia bata kitabu ni la yadu luto fo yewo kanu katambi kodola latinna mu munya na katala ya limania ya dankenia ala ko wa anfiqu mimma ama fa kullu ako wa mim mimma mimma min ba'd bondiro kabo ala ya alharje min ama fa be bon hani kabo ibe fenne bon de la ala subhanahu wa ta'ala amin dila jam mo jama ikaje ko atama mam fensoto mam fensoto mam fensoto wallahi dol la fuaria ani sahabu la fuaria etala wallahi taala ne fuaro fe sahabul kono ite lai ba fala hani o fonne ne manso me kelin na fali kelin 
الى عليه الصلاه والسلام انا الصحابه الوسيله مسدوناتا اكون تندروكي الو تكيلا كنا عليه الصلاه والسلام اكو كيلا كو لفته ينفتو نم فندينا اكو كيلا عليه الصلاه والسلام يا كما ولد عجيبه انا تا نعمر دي دوما ديتا ديتا امام فنف ونال كو كيلا عليه الصلاه والسلام على داجيكو amal lafi musonyinna barisa amal tale ka fay amal lafi kedo wulta ko kila ko ni man hajjo soto je yen futundi inta solata lafta ila alayhi salatu salam ayaku ngawle na kay ko ta fennati ngadila ke otata ayaita anata ako mam fen soto je ila ani hisrata sanka ta hani konna le konna konna ya nati ngadi musol ay ke futu na fulo atata anata amam fanza jumale futa ta je ha niko moyo ko ta ay muso min kane kay ko ta 3000 dollar ya nati aba nati la sense ينجي في اتاتا اناتا اماسط اف والله ما مفنسط الو تاكو كلا كو لفت من نسان نني مفانو نغا من سيتي مبادي لا موسولا نو اكاي كو جي يا ديالا ابي من دونا فنتابو نا من كني مفانو اترتا نو نا نوتا اكا كوله جونكو كونو اي سي بون كونو كابات نا جاتا اي سيتي اي الله اكبر Ah, ndel ni ndel ni ko aliyaje kabri na tan kanyi na dum jama be mbul alhamdulillah sahabo ni fani kire jelle be te bulu sakantu ma musu kunda wardrobe ka fa fay ka do sarse yohani sain to le kumbo ka fuaria 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 ila mata ila qam allah ko wala na funsi ni o kele ye domondi ngom min soto adi bi sabili la sakantu ma nyi ndula wallahi ni la ko do do jabe kele sadati abe bori la fo jenni yom al qiyamate lola because ima ke mo ya ke fonle ni jami mo to stop la insha allah fo jenni yom al qiyam ye la dola kilin dundi je akata dola fula daraka akata sadaqatun jariya sadamu ya na ka tu bori la doro alama alen na so mata ngala the sheikh he continued he mentions that the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam he says in the hadith that sadaqa is burhan sadaqa is proof giving charity he says the scholars they say it is a proof of the person's iman The one who gives sadaqah is a proof of the person's faith. He said, the one who gives sadaqah, the reason why, because this shows the person gives away something that he loves. He said, money is very sweet. The wealth is very nice. And no one gives up his wealth, his money for something, except that he loves that thing more than his money. He says so indeed no doubt if the person he gives the wealth for the sake of Allah and that shows he loves it more than the wealth he says Allah mentions in the ayah the meaning of which in english it says and spend from that which Allah has provided you the sheikh he says Allah is saying don't spend all of it Allah gave it to you but he's not saying spend all of it Allah is saying spend some of it some of what Allah has given you in the way of Allah fi sabilillah he says wallahi some people they say i am poor i am poor i am poor but our poverty is no doubt no way comparable 
to the poverty of the Sahabas. It is unmatchable. He says, to show you this, one time the Prophet وسلم, he was sitting with his Sahabas. A woman, she came and she gave herself to the Prophet وسلم, She told him, I want you to marry me. And the Prophet وسلم, he looked at the lady and then he bowed his head. After bowing his head, it took some while. The scholars, they say, look at the manner of the Prophet ﷺ. How beautiful his manner is. He did not want the lady, but because of where they were sitting, he felt shy to say no to her. So when he kept quiet, one of the Sahabas, he got up. He said to the Prophet, if you have no need of her, then give her to me. Let me marry her. So the Prophet ﷺ, he said, no problem. Then go and find something that you will bring to pay to her. Then we will marry you to her. So the man, he went, he came back. He said to the Prophet ﷺ, I found nothing. The Prophet ﷺ, he told him, ah, then go find anything. Even if it's a small ring, bring it. So you can pay the bridal price. We will use the ring and then we will marry you to her. So the man, he went, he came back, he, need, he told the Prophet ﷺ the same thing, I found nothing. The Sheikh, he says, Subhanallah. He says, if a man wants to marry a woman he loves, he doesn't mind even paying $3,000 today, he will bring the money. He says, so this man, he wanted to marry this lady, he told the Prophet ﷺ, I will give her my robe. He had only one clothing. He said he will give this to the lady. The Prophet ﷺ, he told him, Subhanallah, then what will you wear? The Sheikh he says, This man, that was the only thing he used to have. That was the only clothes he had. He says, The man he used to sit, anytime the clothes got dirty, he would wash the clothes and stay hiding until the clothes got dried. And then he would go back and wear it. That was the only clothing he had. Only one cloth. And he was ready to give it up for this lady. He says, subhanallah. He says, even himself, he has more than one clothing. But alhamdulillah, he has been wearing this. And he has more. He says, so are some of the people. He says, even the women, they all have many clothing. Some of, sometimes, some of them, they have so many clothes that their wardrobes are full. And they're even pouring out of clothes. He makes a dua, he says, may Allah help us to give in his path and for his sake. Nguyen mwai na karamu maado ustazo shekho shahali chan gambia doli alo. Akolo na bijay kahmiya bin baz. Rahim Allah. Bin baz ko lungolo Muslimo nyanna katala aisada bondi. Lungolo. Ako hanna tara riyal kili nam riyal. Altolla jansafo hanna tara dola kili. Dola gambia hanna tara lungolo ndala sikili. Abondi. Ikai mune. Ako kila ako sallallahu alayhi sallam. Sallallahu alayhi sallam. Ma min yawmin. يصبح العباد فيه إلا وملكان ينزلال لنتج جمل فنكتة لمومن وملائكة فلا يجي كبوسا مسند نبدوالا نبدان كارولا مبدوالا كم نفع اللهم أعطي منفقا خلفا Mari, beda ni la minka di ajose ya ya. Saya minka dan karoke, agafa Allahumma a'ti mumsikan talafa. Alam beda ni la minka buloja abuka sonka di ya kasaro kaya. Allahu Akbar. Walatina Sheikh Rahimahullah, ako lungo lungo. Inyana sada abondila hanna tara dola kilinem 
anna tala real killing nem danko ise nyim malaiko la dua soto ye tanka nyindola la danka rola muslimo nyinemo kila alihi salatu salam na banketi ndolbe lingalo nko nyimu mo kendola ika faya dua nye dua nye malaiko la dua fele ate boy la nindol be nga molo iko woli olem ndol la jamma jana lo bari jana aka pa so jo ita fo ka sa mas du wani no la do le ta fo mali ka ta du wani no la malaikul la du wafan allahumma a'fi munfiqan khalafa mari min kabun di kadi a jose wala tinna garanti le nyinte 100% garanti sada abu kana fulo tala Sada Abu Kanafu lo tala abada yemi mbondi ya dum fi sabilillah wallahi amanna fu lo tala bada kam ne ke akayirwan ala munafu ako ma anfaqtum min shay'in fa huwa yukhlifuhu ali fin wa fin bondi ala laka jose hadithu nada ko ma naqasat sadaqatun mala ako sada anene man nafulo tala wala tinna kana pisal abondi abondi na karamu ma sheikh jibril amir ali alon jibril kujab rahimahullah akulun da be sirin fentabul 500 kilo wala babu modon na da ka sheikh o fente so kono eh ata fana aje ko de baso be je din musol be tabirola batu ngani ndo bon aj wandi ayadi ala ako ada da manjam fo do nata 1005 ay wala diala ka shekho duwa allah wa ma anfaqtu min shay'in wa huwa yukhlifu ali al dir mun ka diro ka ali nyinin ka wal buka strande ma fo ka ke millionaire ti hanide bara ta fanam buka fode muna tinna aka bondi al nga bondi nga dundi jam ni ya bondi ya dunja wallahi ya ke alai subhanahu wa ta'ala abe jolal ala lahi do buka baya the sheikh he continues to say that we have heard from our sheikh ali cham he says that he mentioned that the great scholar bin baz rahimahullah he mentioned a statement that every single day a muslim he must give sadaqa every single day he must give charity even if it's one riyal even if if it is one dollar as we know it here or in gambia even if it's one dollar he says why the sheikh he says because of the hadith of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam he says there is no day that the people they wake up except there are two angels who descend one he makes a prayer for the people and one he makes a curse upon the people and the one who makes a prayer for the people he says to allah o oh allah give to the one who spends and the one who makes a curse he says oh allah withhold and destroy from the one who refuses to spend he says so the sheikh he says for this reason sheikh bin baz he said so every single day the son of adam he should give sadaqa so that he will be saved how by getting the first angels dua and secondly by being free from the curse of the second one because as we know he says the dua of the angels are surely accepted he said we have we find people who go around today they will travel distances to ask people for dua you will find them when they say oh so and so is a person of allah they will go to him and say to him please make dua for me they will go to so and so sheikh please make dua for me so and so imam please make dua for me some people will travel so far they will go to places in gambia or in our country kasamas and some will go to mali only 
to ask people to pray for them because they believe the prayers of those people will be accepted. He says, here you have two angels whose prayers no doubt will be accepted because the prayers of the angels are accepted. Allah has given you the angel who make the prayer that Allah to spend and give the one who spends and to withhold from the one who withholds. He says, so this is a 100% guarantee that the one who spends in the part of Allah, he will get. And the one who refuses, then he will not. He says, Allah mentions in the ayah, the meaning of which in English, he says, whatever you spend in the part of Allah, Allah will surely return it. He says, this is a guarantee that the one who spends in the part of Allah, he will get. He says, surely giving for the sake of Allah, it does not reduce the wealth. He says it comes in the hadith of the Prophet وسلم, that the one who gives sadaqah, no rather, sadaqah does not decrease wealth. He says sadaqah never decreases the wealth. He says rather sadaqah increases the person's wealth. Whosoever gives sadaqah increases his wealth. He says he's not saying that if you give sadaqah, you will become a rich person. No. But surely if you give sadaqah, you will never lose. You will never be without wealth. Allah will always give you. Because why? You are always spending for the sake of Allah. He said, so this should encourage all of us to always spend for the sake of Allah. Because Allah will keep giving us. He says, it comes something that happened with one of their sheikhs, Sheikh Jibril, Rahimahullah, may Allah have mercy on him. One day, he was sitting by and he had only 500 with him. He had only 500 cash with him. And a man came to him. The man, he said to him, Oh, Sheikh, Wallahi, today I have no food in my house. And the Sheikh, he looked at his own house and he saw that he had some food because his wives were cooking. So he said to himself, Well, today I have some food. And this man has, so, has no food. So let me give him my 500. Even though that 500 was the only thing he had, he gave it to the man. And he said, the sheikh, as he got up and he left, before it took long, someone came to him and the person gave him 1,500. He says, Allahu Akbar. Look at this. The sheikh, he gave 500 for the sake of Allah. Allah gave him back three times. He says, so no doubt, those who give, they will surely never be without wealth. Whoever gives, Allah will surely pay them. Molbetara <laughs> Bari, who call you at a yawnya? Kando be carrying yawnya, Dolte will Kando Mutala. Imana, Dolte will Kando Kalamutala. Abeo Molkono, Sada Bondila. Atela Sada, Kamim Bondi, Visa Bidilla, will be Kalaya Ea Kondisan. Will it be Kela Palan Soroti? Will it be Kela for your demand? When you had it to enter the yard. Had it to be a Sahi Hay. A Kosabo Atu, you will do whom Allah who feel Billy, Yo Mala Villa, he loved it. More Ola, Allah be Dundil Alla Dibe Mokoto, look Namian could deben decay, Name could deben. And you for the radiologic sort of a sadaqati, but a ha 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 ha
hatta la ta'lamu shimaluha aw shimaluhu ma tunfiqu yamina Mole yanu kai sada da kwa Ayake fi sabilillah ayake ala kama anata ma Anata ma hani abadin sutumo amalan kokari da yin sada Wala na ko ayama bufo amara bulo amalon abulu ba bulo ya min gol nin kan mako ayake fi sabilillah wato in surata minna hadith fulu anin hadith fulan jango ya rafan sada bundilal ibe molle kono miyalon ko alfiya malumo ala kando ita kala Alnga bundi roke isaje sinin sama nzeko ya mazo Alnga di roke sinin sama alkiyamu lungula kando mtolta kala Wala na ala kumanda lari yukuridu allaha qardan hasana Juma lebe ala dontola dontol nyimala abeju ala yawma kiyama ala ma ala mbulo umo Wallahi mbadi ngon bela firi Nambulo fainyo, isari ninjami na etimma kaira kwa. Ninjami na ke muslimu ultati kwa jenni yoma kaya. Niye domondi mbondi, kare domondi mbondi. Abi taala, bi idhni Allahi tabaraka wa taala. Andu mote kumbula, walillahi lehani. Wala na jama aninkafo nyonta. Isi kuke miyana mko sembole ka wulindi. Bari mokini ntijie mumbe kumbula wala onka za akuliyati. Mota kalamu. Alam alaihi nadi. So the Sheikh he says, what he mentions about giving charity, he mentions the hadith of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. He says, the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam he said, indeed, there will be some Muslims who will come. On the day of judgment, what they used to give of charity, this is what will save them on the day of judgment. He said, and we all know that on the day of judgment, the sun will come very close. He says, we all know that that day it will be extremely hot. He says, we all know that people will be sweating so badly that some people they will be sweating all the way to their ankle. He says some people will be sweating all the way to their knee. Some people will be sweating all the way to their waistline. And some people will be drowned in their sweat completely because of the heat of that day. He says some people will be drowned in their sweat completely. He says, but no matter what, there will be people on that day no matter how hot it will be, there will be some people on that day who will not feel any heat on that day. He says, and among those people will be those who used to give sadaqah for the sake of Allah. He says, this sadaqah will be their AC, their air condition. This sadaqah will be their umbrella against the heat of the sun. He says, this sadaqah will be they are cool breeze on that hot, severely hot day. He says, another hadith, it mentions that there will be seven on the day of judgment. Seven groups of people, they will be under the shade of Allah. He says, these people, they will be under the shade of Allah for the good characteristics that they used to have. One of them, he gave... One of those people who will be among these seven, he used to give sadaqah for the sake of Allah. And this person, he gave charity so secretly, such that his left hand doesn't know what his right hand gave. He said, this man, this woman, this person, he gave sadaqah so secretly, such that his close relative does not know what he gave out of charity. He says, by the close relative, you will see. This is why the left hand, which is close to the right hand, does not know what the right hand gave. Because 
of how secretly this person he gave the sadaqah. He says, Subhanallah. Look how the charity saved these people. He says the point he wants to get from this is that let us give sadaqah for the sake of Allah. He says, let us give sadaqah because tomorrow, the one who gives sadaqah, he will be saved. He says, because tomorrow, the one who gives sadaqah, there will be no heat for that person. He says, whoever gives for the sake of Allah, that person, Allah promises, he will surely return it to them. He says, so we should all give, even if it's a little bit, so that we will maintain the masajid that we have. He says, so that this masjid that we have, it will be here until the day of judgment. He says, because if we all give a little, it will not be heavy on anyone, such that someone will come and say, oh, it was too heavy on me, I gave too much. He says, no, if we all give a little bit, then it will be easy for everyone, and this will help us to succeed. He makes dua, he says, may Allah help us. <laughs> Jaman o sotota, konko sotota. Jaket, muslimo de batari, madinam kol de batari. Usman ibn Affan, business bale, business man. Nyonko mekebe sabah, wala min siyata wote, ube tata nang, kamar sanji so naji. Kumar sanji so be mudomu. Very la ñu ko mo naati ibe la la bunda la korda bunda business la ya la ko wolle mo business la balti e borita e tata usman no mo naati na e tata fu ko mar san bi so san a ja bulu sain ka sai ko business la ka kenya ni toli a sai na ya price wo chika I don't know Usman Khan. I go not here no more. Boy, I'll be smiling. I go last day when you mark the beach with the Geneva killing killing wafila. Ya wafila. Don't. Did ham killing? Make the young lady did ham fula. Akwa, eh? Jangan moje biye fedi na mi warta wati de. No. Inyo jibe. Okay, so I'm problem fi je. Dirham killing, bega nyanila dirham nan. Akwa, eh? Hani. Atol ma mpare sandiro. Jangan moje, I fedi na mi warta wati. Ika usman problem fi je say, dirham killing, Nega nyende la dirham lulu. Apa no? Minta mana? Moe fendi nami warta. Iko Usman hani. Ntol le business la tija. Ntol kola moti je mise jo jim price la. Apa ko ala azza wajal? Ayenjo dirham kilin na dirham tan. Allah ka. Albasi ala bang. Iba ando nola. Iko dalta. Kakwal sesede ya kwa nyindomorol abeduna aliyatimu wala bumol. Nyindomorol abeduna fuwaro wala bumol. Wallahi aya janja wale nyama kopa gaso bebat. Atijara maam. Mbena kumu lani ladami musol. Musol. Musol sela mweba. Ila alihi salatu salama ya kutubu oke. I kewal kachan, I kewal kachan, atama tawale nyama fafu tatamusul. 
usolve koma afuta tema bilal baada ako ya ma'shar an-nisa tasaddaqna altul musul al salabundi jahannam ngaje musul la siyata ci subhanallahi ay musul ya mali ya sadabun ay musul susun di kasadabun walud la to bilal ya la dindi ko fene musul ke da tulu total bondi kake bulala dindi ko ikela konnal bondi sanol kake bilal la dindi ko fajuru mataji musul mbalto le sasla in jami'o ay timma walillahi alhamd andu alba kena musul al wasabu fo kriye al yenyo susundi kasada bondi al yefengo fendi ala lanko ala baldo ninne mo daniro ya lanko ba dani la musukul dala momo ya lanko e muso manna altul kewol kono dukare akatandi yimbe sejo yebo ndol man fenso to naman ke alata andi yom al qiyama nda fen karala je fo ngam yem ba ayo bije diya tanya bak bar wadu akan sunu le fana ako man amila salihan falinas momo ya baraken doke ifam wa man asaa ni miya jaw yan di fana ifam ada madingo ila ko ani hisratu salam asafu mali nanafulo 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 ako femman tara ala nafulo femman tara e ala nafulo do na man ke fen sabat na min be ma bo aman ke ndol tati folo de ko fen sabat ye min be ka fu nyoma aman ke tati folo de fen sabat do wala mi te tati ma akala hu fa afna ye min domo aye balo nun kundi aye balo mala mala ndi o mi te tati ye min san dindi ko la yadu fo ya fara atolta o fana mi te tati bari hani dendi ko yemin san aman ko to folo o man keta ni fata bi ibaje la modo ya do sabanjango wala mu yemin tambe di ya bi ala la fi sabilillah ibe wotara la kabro to ibe wotara la yom ala fonye na man ke ni sabo ni muna mi tati ji tanti ji muna nan ba ma ba muna din da ala don to munatin nan ta la kera san munatin nan ta fi sabili la kela iba ma bolo doro ye jumale je afata ya ne ko do ba ye jumale je afata ya na la moto samba ni wala ata kere ko to ala domo halalan tayyiban ila dimbal yoma halalan tayyiban bari anfiq fi sabili diro ke ya ala don to subhana fi sadi yala bunjamolo ala ma alain nadi yo usado al bijam bawo sada bondo dem ko yo susundi e to finance macro fono ta nyo susundi nyo hanen al infaq fi sabilillah abe mo kairo le alama alen nazo kaira the sheikh he mentions he says we should all try we should all do our best to do business with allah we should all do our best to do a business with allah he says we will never lose he says by allah whosoever does business with allah that person will always win they will never lose he says he mentions what happened with uthman ibn affan he says there came a time the muslims were very poor during that time hunger was so much that there were people seeking food he said uthman ibn affan had 300 camels that went and came with goods and everything that we came with was food everything that they came with was all food 
when all those 300 camels they came and they sat in front of the house of Uthman ibn Affan the big businessmen they rushed to him they ran towards Uthman ibn Affan they told him we want to buy all of your goods so that we can sell it to the people for a profit so they say they asked him that they will pay double for whatever Uthman will charge so that Uthman will sell all his goods to them. Uthman ibn Affan, he told them, Ha, I found someone who has promised me that he will pay me more than that. Allah Akbar. So the businessmen, they said to him, Okay, then we will pay you four times whatever your price is. Uthman ibn Affan, he told them, Ha, I have someone who promised to pay me way more than that. So the businessman, they told him, okay, then we will pay you five times whatever your price is. So Uthman ibn Affan, he told them, ha, huh, I have someone who has promised to give me way more than that. The businessmen, they were confused. They told him, no way, that's not possible. We are the big businessmen in this place. He says, they said to him, so how come there will be anyone who can pay more than we can pay? Uthman ibn Affan, he told them, Indeed, Allah has promised he will give me ten times everything that I will spend. So can you beat that? They said, no, no way. So he told them, then bear witness that everything that you see, it shall be spent and giving to the poor people. Allah Akbar. The Sheikh, he says, see this point. That Uthman ibn Affan, he spent everything for the sake of Allah. He says, but what he wants to point out to, to advise the woman. He says, please, the woman, I advise you. He says, please listen to this advice. He said, the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam, he advised the men. One day he came, he advised the men, and he went through advising the men, advising them until he reached the woman. When he reached the woman, he told them to give sadaqah. He told them, oh, you women, give sadaqah. He says, because I have found that the majority of the people of the hellfire will be women. He says, inna lillahi wa inna ilahi rajiun. Indeed, this is great. He says, the Prophet ﷺ told the woman, so please give sadaqah. Give sadaqah. And he said, Bilal, an, he placed his stove. And the women started giving out sadaqah and they gave so much sadaqah they gave all of their earrings they were giving gold and all of their jewelry for the sake of allah as sadaqah he says so the women be like those women do not let anyone build this masjid except you he says spend for the house of allah he said create whatsapp groups remind each other to spend for the sake of allah because indeed whatever you spend allah will give it back to you he says, any man who is present and your wife is not present, please give them this message that they should spend for the sake of Allah so that on the day of judgment, we and them all will be saved. He mentions the ayah, the meaning of which in English, Allah says, whoever does good, indeed, he does it for himself. And whoever does evil, indeed, no doubt, the consequences only he will face. He says this ayah brings him sometimes great pleasure and sometimes it brings him great sorrow. He says, the hadith, the Prophet ﷺ, he mentioned, he said, the son of Adam, he complains to Allah every time, Oh Allah, my wealth. Oh Allah, my wealth. Oh Allah, my wealth. And he says, the Prophet ﷺ, he said, that indeed, no doubt, nothing of his wealth belongs to him, except three things. He said, nothing of the wealth of the son of Adam belongs to him except three things only. And he repeats this. He says, the first one, that which he ate until his body has grown some weight. And the second one, the clothing that he wears until the clothing became old, very old, and it wears off. He said, but, but even the clothing that he bought that is new, it doesn't belong to him. If he dies today, no doubt that clothing will be given to somebody else to wear. He says, Subhanallah. So look at this. 
Even the clothing he buys for himself, it is not his. He says the third one, that is for the son of Adam, is what he spends for the sake of Allah. He says, then what is yours after these things? Tell him what is yours after these things. He says, Wallahi, nothing belongs to you after these things. So why then do we hide the wealth from Allah? Why then do we keep the wealth away from spending in the path of Allah? He says, have you ever seen anyone pass away and they bury him with his wealth? Have you, any, have you ever seen anyone pass away and they bury him with his cars? He says, have you seen anyone pass away and they bury him with his wealth? He says, no, no doubt. They do not bury him with these things. They only go with their deeds. He says, but he's not saying do not spend on yourself. He says, spend and eat from the halal. Spend and take from the halal. But don't forget to spend in the part of Allah. He makes dua and he asks Allah to help us. And he says that indeed it is a day that we want to encourage everyone to spend. So he would like to pass by the imams and give them the mic as well. So that they may encourage us and everyone else to spend in the way of Allah. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وآله وصحبه أجمعين ما بعد ما رموا ولا تيجنا سبحانك ما ماما وسيرنا نجيب تهونتنا وترمو أربعة تيجن خوات تمارين الله محمد صلى الله عليه وآله وسلم Allah kubenya ni akhifari ni. Allah rasulam dona kha na ya khifari kati oya. Nimi suwa sandana aru kongondana. Nimi suwa sayinga sirwa sire dati wula ni gitabunga. Sire bega tungun ni ti Allah di fari nga. Na waradu fari mba fi sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam. Yalli Allah ga hukam kum. Gongondeng na sirwa sire dati kira majidabunga. Sire bega matungun ni ti Allah di fari nga. Amara Rufarim Batri Sallallahu Alaihi Wa Alaihi Wa Sallam Yandai Allah Jalla Tisku Yandai Gihalli Ona Jaman Chusus Nawari Surabayru Gatte Kepira Kamma Na Okha Mughan Nawari Agada Budigan Kallam Muntobe Kuli Odenen Diga Mubeen Diga Dobaga Diga Mubeen Diga Wase Baraka Kuni Khanne Kebedi Jaman cemerlang akan nak kemuku, ilan li agak yin le akan nak kebedi, jaman cemerlang akan. Agar aku dekau dengan ini, sila suwan nanti. Tono bega kemuku di, iga manja kana ke ya di malanya Allah ke. Bari, ada marin mehon tano. Igan kini kati aya, ambilan tahun lawan di nanti Kenya, agam pasan dah koi kebe gan do Allah cinta ni. Kenta. Ada mana membrain lawan di hoho gak kena anda gan di nanti kasa. Kenya, awak posronan, kem pontan nga agam pasang monta kebe kenga arjan nanti anak tak. Idan kebe kenga komen cinta ni Allah, afdal ni aku di sini. ما يقربك إلى الله هو هو جن تدنين الله أم بسند هو هو سوي هو هو جن يا نصب هو يا لدخل الجنة نلولي الجنة أم بسند هو هو سوي كندي 
Oga na ketare benya community dan tanto no gondi. Oga da diga mu belu mu oga di kenta. Ina mani kamma. Nanti tondi Allah. Nalondi aljana. Kendi mani to ganda ngani. Gulle anyengi. Hadamare menka. Biru ubire. Diga menka kebe kamma kuno. Ega ni hunya kebe ganti tondi ni Allah. Hanya kebegal lu nene aljana, anna tu nanti kenga kuni biru biru antaronga muku, oh tanawan orang kenga munda antaron teh am magamuru, kenga ni syaitan. Karena Allah kan aku rasulullah taala, syaitan lu ni amal ni timania, alfaqah, fukarah, kau fukarah ni kau. Kebe kau maga na koyang kena nanti hari kerja kebe kau tu nanti kebe kau ni. Awan tinjau ni ni Allah, dia bukan ni. Awan lu ni ni ajan. Angan aku bukan di subuh tu atau kamu bukan. Eku bucin nu anak yang magam bangkit tu orang nanti nak nak punya bukan ni. Ibu bukan di kiri. Angan ni ibu bukan dia. Antanya antanya angan tanggul. Angan tanggul ni kira macam gul gul ni hilal. Angan tu mabos sungai katam. Setan itu aku arun apa kerja nu orang ni. Yang bos sungai nak kata kubu nu kamu bukan ibu bukan ni. أنا مم بندو الله الله كيف سبحانه وتعالى أي جدًا تجنب اللي تدور نجارن مطن نجاري نجارن برادو أن هذا نجى الله وما من دابة في الأرض إلا على الله رزقها الله نجني جارن مطن نجاري سك سوس سوس تكنا كن دي لا بد هذا مر مكسين ما يجناني أجارين نسو أن وراني كلنا بيرسون نجى الرزق والحرمان مجراهما بما قضى الله وما قدر. أن نرجع لك قارتنا ألا ما قال الله كركيب ربك أن أن كن كذا كن مليون أنا نعمها مليون أنا نعمها سيتان ما أن كانوا دينا بغندي نجي أن نركيب عند بعد أنيم. No أن نرجع لك قارتنا ألا ما قال. أجت هو كيف يركننا؟ سكر تلي أنت فكر دونا. Na kutenda kono, kini anga na mani, ana ni Allah, kamu mara na yamaga, muni mara na yamaga, na wake chabi na yamaga, aya na kina nga, anga na kiri kati, Allah dina choro kani nga, Allah kanchi kini nga, anto kwa hali mani kani nga, maga to hali kani. Aha, dunaga ada mukombe, dunaga mukokem, ada kene bagai apa? Ini ni tuan orang tu dunaga mukombe ni ada bawa, dunaga oh hua gaya hal yang kau yang dega, dah kara jom kau ingin nak tu yang agar ini, wali kuli wa idin minhu ma balu, kuno min abna il akhir, dunaga mungan. Anga roho ngali, anga njutsuki nike dunai, kekasi indie, anna tuna titunare mahunta humachenye. Alla kumusran na kawantana anka hunchi ni anjana. Anna anka hunchi ni ni anjana. Kanu hili amma gaduna marime na amma gaduna. Kanu siki wa amma gaduna marime na amma gaduna. Kanu karagia na amma gaduna panduru susiki nike. Senegali susiki ni. Dakar susu segini, mari menambahkan aljana nukodni. Anga dengan rekam mukaran nali na duna segini, anna buru duna nukodni, anki tu duro, jik dumu na furada, anki tu duro na negani me Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, anda ho ho masagi, anki nak karu kali tuan pale duna, anda karu kan mi tuan pale duna, si ribar itu cuma aljana nukodni, anda kan mari kan Allah, mari. Akati mbaye amma ka shekhi nda koni oda nga mbaye. Ibi ga me tere suga la na kawa kiruna ni mbaye. Bari sere suga ji. Business na li nga anda. Jagunde na li nga anda nga anda. Jagunde kena nyana du maribati. Nga anna ntone anna wakita. Mea di jagunde bega mpasa sui keni. Na jagunde nye ti Allah. Barani nga na jagunde nye ti Allah ya anda katono bi kita. Hana, anda pergi ni, anda berindel lena, Allah bari kita di sini. Anda berindel lena pada anda pun. Awan tolong kagari agaran cinta ni, jangan kagari Allah di sini sembari tuan. 
Ujine 